Y'all probably can hear that music in the background. That's Mr. Frazier listening to the evolution of hip hop since over so many years, 20 years or something he said, I don't know. Me, I have on a nightgown, it's just a little loose so it looks like nothing is on. It used to show up here at least. That's what happens when stuff don't fit the same. Anyway, and don't mind this, this is my coat belt buckle. How's everyone been? I think the last vlog y'all saw was when we were outside doing like suicides and all that good stuff. So I hadn't picked up the camera since then. So yeah. So yeah, everything has been cool. I've just been still sticking to my keto. Um, the girls have been cool. They're getting ready. Naya and Keela are getting ready for a dance competition. That's in literally two weeks, maybe three. So they've been having a lot more practices. They have uh, uh, two practice, two extra practices, I think, this week. Another one the following week. Then they got a whole dress rehearsal. They just got a whole lot, a lot of going on because these, I guess they want to make sure they win this competition. What else is going on? Nothing else, really. Baby, have I missed anything that we haven't discussed with them in a while? Nothing has been going on, has it? Yeah, it has been boring, so we haven't picked up the camera. Here comes husband, so he can say hi to y'all. <laughs> Guess I'll hit y'all up later. I think Terrence might be going, well, he is going to the store. Maybe he could take y'all to the store with him. I don't know. He might not want to vlog at the grocery store by itself. Just to give y'all some more content. So, yeah. But, see y'all later. Alright, y'all. So, I went ahead and threw a shirt and some um, black pants on. So, I'm about to make some meatloaf. I'm making two different kinds. I'm making a very small one for myself and Yanni. Um, and then I'm making a meatloaf for the rest of the family using breadcrumbs or whatever. Um, I'm gonna actually, since, you know, we don't eat pork and no pork rinds and stuff, for myself and Yanni, we're gonna, I'm gonna try to use these Parmesan crisps for like the crunchiness. I don't think it's gonna work out right. I feel like it's gonna melt. <laughs> but we gonna see, cause this is the only crunchy thing I got and I don't wanna put no almond flour, honestly, in my meatloaf. I, it might be a fail, but the, the rest of the family's meatloaf will be fine. Me and Yanni will have a backup dish if our little meatloaf we making doesn't come out right. But everybody else is going to have normal meatloaf that I normally make. So, this is some of the stuff that I'm going to be using for my keto meatloaf. Or whatever. And then this is like barbecue sauce, ketchup, breadcrumbs, and meat, onions, green bell. Yeah, you know, all that's going to be for theirs. But... I'm making a small one, like I said, and then a normal large size, size one for the family. And they're going to have like probably some cornbread, which I think I might try to make some keto cornbread. So we're going to see. I need to look up a recipe for it. And then um, probably some broccoli, something like that. I thought about making mashed potatoes for them, but I don't want to do meatloaf, mashed potatoes, and cornbread. Ain't no really vegetable, so I don't know. But we'll see. So um, I'm going to try to show y'all here and there of what I do, um, but it's not going to be like a full cooking video. I'm just coming to y'all starting this vlog off from the last vlog I uploaded because I said I was going to. So hey, y'all. Hey. It's the same day, but it's a new video so i hope you enjoy yes i'm cooking in my bonnet bonnet chronicles i had a wig on earlier when i was outside but took it off because the head was sweating husband is outside now washing my car so i'm in here cooking and the boys are outside helping keila's still in the living room from earlier um yeah and i don't know she had painted my nails earlier y'all i've been trying to scrape it off i ain't got no polish remover um, I realized I didn't like the color on my little bitty nails, so I tried to scrape it off. I need to buy some peanut polish remover. So anyway, I'm about to cook.
Also, here's my keto meatloaf mixture. I like a lot of green pepper. So green pepper, onions, um, all this seasoning, plus my pink Himalayan salt. I put some of this in my actual meat mixture. This and this will go on the top. Um, and then this is the families, just breadcrumbs, onions, bell peppers, all the little seasonings, regular barbecue sauce. I always add it to my meatloaf eggs and all that good stuff so now i'm about to just form these and get them in the oven all right y'all so one i had to change shirts because i got food all on my shirt when i was cooking <laughs> something the ketchup splattered all on me but i already started eating i forgot so here was my keto meatloaf it was really good my um cauliflower and um, sour cream and chive um mashed potato well mashed potatoes and the uh meatloaf is really good yanni liked it wait y'all can't see like her so why didn't you like the cauliflower mashed potatoes i didn't say i didn't like it but you just said i like the meatloaf Can I tell the meatloaf. About my hold on there she go you was i was what just talking about the meatloaf but i you said okay did you like the cauliflower mashed potatoes it was cool what was cool Mama. it was different Yes, son. What was this Yours was meatloaf, regular meatloaf. But yeah, the meatloaf turned out to be a success. So it's really, really good. I'm so happy. Um, and I'm drinking my Powerade Zero. So yeah, everything was good. Husband's back there making his food because he's not eating this. None of it. No, he's making, I think, eggs and something. Whatever's on his meal plan. But... Everything was good. Meatloaf is nice and moist and flavorful. And tons of the, uh, bre the a little so Parmesan, the Parmesan crust. I mean, the whatever it was it. I don't know if it melted in it or not. I can't tell, but it's good. So, I will most definitely be making this again. It tastes just like regular meatloaf. So, minus the breadcrumbs or crackers or whatever people put in there. So, yeah, this was a win. Alright, y'all. So, it's later in the night now. This has been a long vlog. Well, because it was another part to it previously. But it's later in the night. And um, what the hell? But it's later in the night. We got the attic fan on, so that's what that sound is. Um, I had to clean up downstairs because I made all that meatloaf and whatnot. That keto meatloaf was bomb. Y'all don't understand. It was so, so, so good. Um, it was on the scale today I got a lot done you know did stuff with the hubby and the kids as far as outside which if y'all need to watch the previous vlog if y'all haven't watched it because y'all probably gonna be like what y'all didn't you didn't do nothing with the hubby and the kids yeah we did this I just didn't want the vlog to be super long so it's part two of the previous one um got dinner cooked earlier than normal um so yeah, only thing I didn't do is my YouTube video for my main channel, which now I'm going to do tomorrow for sure. I think what I'm going to have to do is go to the gym in the morning versus after work. Um, that way when I get home, I can, you know, make sure the kids are straight, beat my face, do this video, and yeah, maybe I could even knock out two. So... Um, I think I'm about to get ready for bed. I hear a kid's TV on that's not supposed to be on, so I'm going to have to go regulate that. Um, so yeah, yeah, I am tired. I'm really tired, but I already know what I'm about to do. After I get off here, I'm going to do nothing but pick up my phone, see what new Netflix movies are out. Watch those. Yeah, so I'm about to get off of here 
and make sure hubby gets upstairs soon so I can be up under him. And I'm about to just relax. So I'll see y'all later.